Hello all, welcome back. In this playlist of link list, now I want to add one more option over here and that is insert at any position. So let me copy this and let me write here the option number five that is insert at any position. And it can be first, it can be last or it can be any. So here I want to write that is case number five. And you can write that is break. Now you can call the function that is insert to and you can pass your head. So definitely I need to write here that is the function that is void insert to and here you can write student pointer at. So now here in this function I need to get first position from the user. So I'm just writing here that is integer position. And I'm just asking over here that is enter position to insert. So you can write here scanf percentage D M percent position. User may enter the position one. So if position is one, it, it means that if position equal equal one, then we can call our function that is insert one and we can pass our head. So it will insert the value at the first, but may be a chance user want to enter the data at the last for example if there are four records and user want to insert the at the fifth position then it may be a chance user can insert the data at the last position so you can declare here one more variable that is n is equal to you can call the function count and you can pass your edge so what it will do it will return you total number of record available in the list now if Position is equal equal and that is n plus 1. It means that if user want to insert at the last then you can call the function create and you can pass your edge. Now might be a chance user can enter the value that is greater than position. If user want to enter the value greater than position then we can simply deny the operation. So if position is greater than n then we can simply inform the user that is index out of bound please try again but might be a chance user can enter the value that is in between so here you can write one more condition and that is else if position greater than zero so if the position is not greater than n but if it is greater than zero then you can get the value that is roll number name and percentage so that we can get from the insert one. So let me copy here the thing that is roll number, name and percentage. You can just simply copy this and you can paste over here in this else if portion. So what happens if, if the position is in between then we need to get the value from the user that is roll number, name and percentage. So that value I want to insert at that particular position that user has mentioned. So what is the logic for the same? So logic to insert at the after position is what? Suppose if user want to insert after the position number that is 2 and want to insert the value that is 2.5. So find the node that you want to insert. For example, after 2, I want to insert the 2.5. So what we need to do? First, simply we need to reach to that particular node and after that we just need to create the link what that is first that is a temporary you can say this is the temporary node so temporary dot next is equal to our pointed node that is two dot next so this link will be created that is temp dot next is equal to head dot next for example if we are iterating then this is the current node then current dot next now we can create the link that is what now this current dot next is equal to temp so another link will be created and that is what that is current dot next is equal to that is temp so you can simply create the link like that so this is the logic now how to write the code so it is very simple you can just write here that is 4 i equal to 1 i less than position minus 1 so you can reach to that particular node that is i plus plus and you can write h equal to h dot next. It means that your current node will be that is the 
before the node that you want to insert. Definitely I need to declare the variable and that is integer i. So let me write here that is integer i. Now once you reach to this particular node, now you can simply write here and that is student pointer. Now you can create the temporary node. So you can write temp is equal to student pointer and here you can write malloc size of that is student. Now here you can simply assign the value that is temp dot roll number is equal to roll number temp dot name and that is equal to name for that you need to write string copy so you can write string copy temp dot name equal to name and temp dot percentage is equal to percentage so the data will be filled into temp now i need to create the link first and the link is what that is this is my temp node right so temp dot next is equal to that is current dot next so here you can write temp dot next is equal to that is h dot next and here you can write that is h dot next is equal to that is temp now you can simply save this and you can build and run this particular application and you will be able to insert the record at any position so for example let me create the list that is roll number 101 name is for example parag shukla percentage for example 72 one more option that is 102 name of the person for example kapil shukla percentage 67 now there are two records available let me insert at any position and the position number one it means i want to create the head node so i'm writing here roll number that is 99 and name of the person devin patel and the percentage is 92 and you can display the data devin patel is there now i want to insert at any position and i want to insert at the last that is at the fourth position and that is for example 103 ankit faldo and the percentage is for example 74 and you will be able to access the last record is ankit faldo now i want to insert in between that is here i want to insert the roll number 100 after parag shukla and before kapil shukla so at the third position so you can write here five position number three and i want to insert the number for example 67 and the name of the person is nishar kalia and the percentage is 82 now you can see that the data is inserted over here that is nishar kalia in between parag and kapil so you can insert at first you can insert at last you can insert at in between. So this is the way you can write the code to insert the node at any position in the link list. So that's it from my side. If you like this video, then please like, share and subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much. Have a nice day.